Tom, that's a... Well, it's, it's been a good week, but it's a frustrating finish because you'd be love, love to be leaving here with nine points from the week instead of seven. It should be, really, if I'm being honest. Um, you know, I wish I could tell you exactly how I feel, but, you know, everyone knows you're not allowed to do that nowadays. So, um, yeah, if, if you haven't seen it, please watch it back. Um, yeah, I mean, if I say any more, no, I run the no, risk I'm... of getting in serious trouble. So, which is a shame because, um, you know, the lads put in a massive effort. It was one of them days today where we weren't, you know, at it a hundred percent. There was a few leggy boys there. You know, it's been a really tough period. There's been a lot of games, and um, you know, when we get in them positions, going one nil up, um, we tend to hang on really, unless something happens. So, um, yeah, hugely disappointing. Um, you know, I've seen it back. Everyone's seen it back, mm. and you know, minimal. I, I think would perhaps be a fair reflection of the um, contact. If uh, <laughs> booking the other way for a time, yeah. if I'm being mm-hmm. honest. But um, yeah, one of them. Obviously, I, I'd love to tell you how yeah. exactly how I feel. But if we can move on before I get in trouble, yes. that would be great. No, I, I understand. Um, but as you say, you, I suppose let's look on the positive then. Uh, of seven points from these three games is a, is, is a decent return. Yeah. Um, yeah, you know, we've been in good form. It'd been amazing to win all these 1-0. That would have been nice, wouldn't it? But um wasn't meant to be. And, you know, like I said, it should have been three points, but let's hope it doesn't cost us come the end of the season um, because that would be hugely disappointing. Um, but let's hope it's a good point in the end and, um, you know, and, and not too drop because it's a tough place to come. And like I said, there was a few leggy boys today. Mm. It's, it's good now. I, I really I really think now um, having this international break has come at a good time mm. for us because, um, yeah, I don't know whether you could tell, but it certainly felt yes. like it when I was out there. That um, Well, you know, I think last season it, it almost it didn't because you'd had that great win at Hull and it sort of built, it was sort of building up. And if anything, it sort of just took, not took the foot off the gas, but it, whereas this time it feels as though people are ready for a rest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you know, when you've got the lads putting the effort in, they do every every week. You know, we got the GPS data coming back through from the games that the sports science do. And, you know, I don't know how some of the boys do it. I know I've probably got one of the cushiest jobs in the middle of a free. Um, and even you I look was, pretty busy know, to me, I, I must you, say. Yeah, even I was struggling today. So, um, yeah, a lot of travelling, a lot of games, a lot of heavy legs and... And not an easy place to come. And when that crowd got going, um, yeah, it was really tough. So, yeah, it is what it is. Um, let's take the positives from it and all that. It would have been nice to go into this break now with, on the back of a win. Um, feel like we should have and, and, and we've done enough too. But sometimes you don't always get what you, what you deserve in football. So um, after they scored, we were, we were never going to go up the other end and score again. So it was just about seeing out the, for the draw then.